recording. Molly, Molly, it will be a video letter to you. I'm good to see you again. You know what? I just recorded this video to Gina. I just watched it on my computer, and my it's like my eyes look very sad in this video. I look so fucking tired. But anyways, I'm, I'm recording another video, and this is, this is for you. This one is for you. I don't know what to say. I I record myself. I'm recording myself now, and I see here. You can see on the screen my kind of. It's like a mirror, you know, like a picture. The way you will see me, and it's kind of funny. But anyways. I don't know, I, I know that people will, people watching this video will, will see that I look sad and, and I have hard times maybe, and I don't know, like I said the last weeks, even more, it's been like almost two months, it was kind of more intense for me because I was all the time here in this noise, in this it's not a big city, but it is a really commercial place. Mankore, it is called, it is in Peru. The beach of Peru, like lots of surfers. It is a very touristic place, many people come here. So, on the other hand, it gave me like possibility to work, as see, doing my massage and my treatments. That I'm very happy I was doing and I hope to continue for some time. Because I learned a lot from that. But at the same time, being all of the time among people, and it exhausts me, you know. Even though I, I give myself a lot of time, and I spend like hours also in this room here, but you know, the very energy here, the very feeling is different. So, uh, the noise you hear and, and such, this very frequency, the very energy, you know, it affects us and it affects me. So after some time, I admit that I that I feel drained. I, I feel like like this. Even though on the other other hand, I I still feel like, like I would. But I'm enjoying that what I do here, like helping. And I was teaching those meditations, doing my massages. And you know why? Also because as I understood that. Those treatments I do, this massage, I do this energy, these healings, giving my presence. While doing it, I take the karma of other person. I take all of this tension, I take this stiffness. It feels like a lot of like stiffness. This stiffness from other person, I take it on myself. So maybe this is why it also kind of drains me a lot. And I have to work on myself to to like make it go away, to dissipate it. But and sometimes you know I just can do like one fucking massage a day, and that person is so much ch charged with this, yes, this karma, this everything. And when I do my treatments, I always give the best I can, even though I charge like only like like fifty, like forty soles, forty fifty soles an hour. It is like. Like ten, like fifteen dollars one hour. It's not much, but I give my full self, and I take these things from the other person. And so sometimes I just do one fucking massage, and it get, and I need one day or two days to clean myself from that. <laughs> but I'm happy about this because. I see that through this, I grow a lot. Like taking this karma, this stiffness from other people and working with it. I help them, but at the same time something within me changes. 
I don't know what changes, but it feels nice simply to love and to care and and give the best you can, even though most of those people are yeah, not even aware of that of what had happened. They just pay this twenty soles, fifty soles, and just. But one day they will understand. One day they will remember. So maybe this is also this is why I feel kind of drained, and this is why my eyes look sad, and definitely they look sad because I just watched this video I did. But I feel good. Like I feel drained and tired, but at the same time I feel kind of fulfilled and happy knowing that 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 my being here is is that I change something, that I, I give something. And this is a very beautiful feeling. Six minutes already. Of recording. So it's very nice to make this video to you, Molly. And you wrote me a few letters which I never responded. I always tried to respond and I was like starting to respond, I would write, but then um, I don't know. Like I said, these were intense times for me and so a lot of time I just needed time for myself and to to read the letters of other people to respond it was kind of difficult and is difficult you know <laughs> it is like when i am communicating with others when i open myself full and i always open myself full <laughs> when i write letters it feels like i also take something from the other person and i also give something so maybe sometimes i need time just to be with myself go to my retreat, stay with myself, come back to myself and be completely clean with my eyes sparkling, shining with its full presence and then go back and write letters, make videos, give meditation classes, help in those ways because if no, then... I don't know... so you wrote me a few letters which I never responded to but I, these were very beautiful letters I received from you and you said that something had changed within you, something had happened with, within you, Molly. You said that that now you feel so much trust in life that you feel yourself like a baby, like a daughter of, 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 of God. And I'm most happy to hear that from you because is the most beautiful feeling just to leave everything to life just to trust it yes also you sent me those seven dollars and seventy seven cents donation he said that you have like twelve dollars on in your this PayPal bank, I don't know. And he said, "I'm Dalama, I'm sending you more than a half of this. <laughs> it's not a lot," he said, "but it goes with my heart." And I was very happy to receive it. I was very happy to, re I mean, to see these donations from people I know, from Gina, from Adam, from people, from people, because it made me feel so grateful and, you know, it just touches the heart. You know that some of you, some of those people, I'm sure that Adam, for example, he also sent me a lot of money. I mean, I mean, I 
I mean, from the money he has, like, I, I know that my friends, they were really generous to me. So... It feels very good, actually, that to receive something from the other person, to receive something with an open heart. Matt, our brother Matt, he also donated me like fifty dollars, and he wrote me like a kind of poem, like poetry, and I was reading it and reading it, and I will read it again, because for me it's kind of difficult to understand poetry. I never understood, but the piece he had written, it truly really tells me something. I will read it again. It's already 10 minutes, 10 mi 11 minutes of this video, so I will end it now. Because if it is more than 100 megabytes, then YouTube will not let me upload it, and I would have to edit it, and I, and I don't want to do this, so... Thank you, Molly. I, I, we want to, to hear a letter from you also, we want to... to re video response or something, I want to see you again, at your beautiful face. So, see you soon, Molly.